simply whip it up. We're gonna make Butterfinger cookies. These are really good, by the way. The reason we're making them is because I wait for them to go on sale. Look at these. I got them for 90 cents. Who would have ever thought Hobby Lobby had Butterfingers going on clearance? <laughs> Probably getting old, but that's the best way to use them and throw them in some sugar and some cookies. Oh, they're good. November 29th, 2023. A half a cup of butter. So one stick. Three fourths cup of sugar. Two thirds cup brown sugar. Two egg whites. And honestly, I just do the whole egg because it drives me nuts wasting it. I'm sucking at this egg cracking anymore. Two egg whites if you want to do it that way. One and a fourth cup of chunky peanut butter. And I'm just actually going to just scoop it and do it this way instead of measuring it. But if you're a measurer, one and a fourth cup. Half a teaspoon of baking soda. So fourth of a teaspoon of salt. So I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit in. One and a half teaspoons of vanilla. One and a half cups of flour. Got to slow, especially since I didn't add my guardrails. About five to six Butterfingers. Pound them out. Open them up and just pour them right in. Getting it all mixed up nice and good. Clean the beater. Cookie scoop. Grab your pan. Go ahead and spray it. Put those in the oven. 350 degrees for 10 to 12 minutes. First batch came out of the oven. Let them cool a little bit and then you can remove them. They're all baked and done. I got approximately 40 Butterfinger cookies on one batch. All taste and no waste.